Good evening. Here are some of the headlines to anticipate against tomorrow, 13th of September, 2023. This is tomorrow's news today. We begin with national news. One dead as truck falls off a Tedola bridge in Lagos State. Nigeria's malaria death rate drops by 55%, says World Health Organization. Federal government orders probing to recurring boat crashes in Nigeria. Governor Akere Dolu sacks media aides of deputy as residents beg the governor to complete road projects. NURTW factions clash in Abuja. Delta women protest headmen attack and rape. Student Union has no power to suspend academic activities, says the Adekunle Ajashi University Registrar. On the kidnapped call members, parents' families resort to prayers and fasting. Police apprehend six people extorting with POS and stealing phones in Imo State. NSCDC parades 10 oil thieves and impounds nine cars in River State. We move to politics. Lagos Tribunal verdict, I wasn't sacked, says Labour Party representative Atta. Kano Assembly suspends local government chairman over sale of government lands. In Plato states, Plato's PDP rejects tribunal judgment and heads for appeal. I don't need titles to serve in Tinubu's administration, says Babatunde Fashola. We move to business news. Worry as Dangote Refinery misses production deadline as Brent crude oil hits $91 per barrel. UBA records 40 billion naira profit before tax. Nigeria Communications Commission approves MTN's Nigeria purchase of 2.6 GHZ spectrum. In international news, North Korea's came in Russia for talks with Putin. U.S. warns on arms deal. Egypt declares three-day mourning after natural disasters hit Morocco and Libya. Insurance of golden visas increased by 50% in Dubai. In technology news, federal government launches power outage reporting app. Apple unveils new products and unique features at Wanderlust. And lastly, in sports, White confirms Adesanya's title rematch. Tennis star Simona Halep suspended for doping. Spanish judge orders Rubiales to testify over World Cup kiss of women's player. Awoniyi wins Nottingham's Foreign Player of the Month and Goal of the Month Awards. Get details of this news and more on our website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspapers from your closest newsstand. Do not forget to follow us on social media at Guardian Nigeria across our social media pages. I am Lois Oguni. Good night.